Welcome back everyone. In today's video, we're going to be visiting Zona Archeologico de Cholula to see the Great Pyramid of Cholula. This place is the largest archeological site of a pyramid in the New World. However, we arrived an hour early, so now we're gonna have to wait. Yet yeah, you can see a little bit of the pyramid right now. Anyway, what we're gonna do is walk up to the church that's on top of the pyramid to get a nice view of the city. You have to take all these stairs all the way to the top it's not very bad, but it just wasn't something I was expecting early in the morning. But I have to admit that the views are worth it. You can see everything from the top, and you can even get a view of Popocatapet. This is an active stratovolcano. At 5,426 meters, it is the second highest peak in Mexico. Now the church that's on top of the pyramid is called Iglesia de Nuestra Señora de los Remedios, Church of Our Lady of Remedies or Sanctuary de la Virgen de los Remedios, Sanctuary of the Virgin of Revenues. This was, built in, this was built by the Spanish in colonial times in 1594. The church is a major Catholic pilgrimage destination, and the site is also used for the celebration of indigenous rites. Many ancient sites in Latin America are found under modern Catholic holy sites due to the practice of the Catholic Church of repurposing local religious sites. Because of the historic and religious significance of the church, which is designated Colonial Monument, the pyramid as a whole has not been excavated and restored. We stayed up here looking at all the views for a while until our stomach started growling, so we went down to go get something to eat. This little place was outside next to the whole pyramid and church structure, so we just thought why not eat here, and actually the food was really good. I really liked it. We head over to the entrance to get our tickets and also to get a guide so that we can learn more about this place. The guide mentioned that these steps and a little bit past are actually built on top of the pyramid. In the museum, we see this diagram sculpture of what the pyramid and all the tunnels underneath look like under the church. This is the Great Pyramid of Cholula. It's also known as a different name, but I can't pronounce it, so I'll put it up the screen. This is the largest pyramid by volume known to exist in the world today. The pyramid is made of adobe brick and stands at 82 feet tall, but it's 984 feet by 1,033 feet. Inside the pyramid are some 5 miles of tunnels excavated by archaeologists. The pyramid is a temple that traditionally has been viewed as having been dedicated to the god Quetzalcoatl. Now this is how the pyramid looks on the outside, and compared to the little structure in the museum, you can't really see much. But there's this cool arena where the echo sounds amazing and I'll show you right now. After the long tour, we were walking around and saw this beautiful church. I don't really remember the name, but it's so colorful and I just thought all you guys would like to see it. Before we go to the next place, see an extinct volcano or geyser. Oh my gosh, there's a little small extinct volcano. We get to go inside. There's stairs over there. And it's called... I'm probably going to butcher the name. Huaxcomate? How do you pronounce it? Huaxcomate. That was close. How do you say? Huaxcomate? <laughs> Came from all the way up there to this inactive geyser. Look at the water. this place. It has underground rivers. And this tiny little waterfall looks so cool. There's this myth that if you put your hand out and you have to wait for this like droplet of water to fall on your hand and when it does that signifies that you're either going to have like good luck in life or that you're going to be able to find your soulmate in life and i thought why not try it but i'm not going to show the whole video because this whole thing took more than two minutes but i stayed there waiting the entire time how do you feel 
Like the world is your way. I feel sorry. <laughs> <laughs> after waiting for so long i got hungry so afterwards we went to a local market to eat mole and also got to see how they make tortillas then we went to the candy shop to get some sweets for the night and to also take back home for our friends and family and the last thing we saw that night was estrella de puebla it's a Ferris wheel located in Puebla de Sargosa. It opened on July 22, 2013. The wheel received the Guinness World Record for the world's largest portable observation wheel with a diameter of 229 feet and a height of 260 feet. And that's the end of the video. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on your notifications for the next adventure.